I talked to uh, uh, Flo two days ago, just for a few, just to say congratulations and about Ray, you know, getting into the Hall of Fame. Yeah, Squire got a Hall of got Hall of Fame on the Water Squire jersey. Ray <laughs> Allen. Yes. <laughs> if you didn't know, I'm letting you know right now. Ray Allen. So, so how how did you meet Ray? I mean, how Ray, did you... we we were at a tournament, you know. Most important thing in business is honesty, integrity, hard work, family. Never forget. You know, we can't go again. Back then, we took two or three teams, uh, some young guys, and everybody else. We took them to a tournament in Myrtle Beach. And I think it was LG Alexander at the time. I still remember most of these guys that used to host all these tournaments, like Dave Cryder and them back in the day, Bob Gibbons, Charlie Weber. But this was LG Alexander. And back in the day, I used to take teams down there, you know, starting with Fats Barry and, you know, Fats Barry, Frank, you know, Ron Kelly, you know, all of them back in the day. Uh, uh, I still remember we went to a tournament down there and JoJo Chain was supposed to play, and that's when he had broke his leg. Uh, and, you know, we were calling JoJo, just seeing how he was and all that. But we used to go to these tournaments. And this one particular weekend, we went to Myrtle Beach. <laughs> and I remember the guys got beat so bad, some of the, our players was like, can we go through the back door? And, and I used to tell them then, no, no, you're going through the front door. This was an awakening. See, my whole thing with this, it, I feel like we we won every time we got killed because it opened their eyes up to some of these local dudes to a national scene. It's not like that. Oh, 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 oh. And we, I remember we ran across one team. They had Jeff Capel, Jeff McGinnis. And it was Jeff, it was Jeff McGinnis, Capel, and it was one other dude that ended up going somewhere to play from down in North Carolina. And I mean, they were having a dunk. I mean, it was it was it was crazy. Uh, it was just crazy. And then I watched a team from South Carolina play, and they had Ray and they had Mike Minifield with their two guys. And the guy that ran that team was a great brother by the name of Robert. And I, I forgot the name of the team. I think it was Met Metro South Carolina or something like that. So we got together and we were talking. And I still remember Ray coming down the lane one time. I'm seeing this guy with these huge calves and this afro and he coming down the lane and just dunk that thing on the whole team one time like what in the world and then i got a chance to meet them and you know we we stayed in touch and he was just like look man i don't do a lot down this way we don't really travel on the east coast he's like man ray and mike you know I, if you if you got some room man you know maybe play you come on down and meet the parents i was like sure so we started talking and i never forget i took my cousin ivan who at that time was playing at manchester high school ivan squire who's now a bishop at a Mormon church in Lexington, married with four kids. Um, you know, he graduated from Richmond. Then he went and got his master's from BYU. And him and I drove six and a half hours to, to South Carolina. And we end up meeting Ray's parents.